there was a sura what had the capacity to emanate lot of heat anala anala sura anala sura and the word anal means heat extreme heat in one of the legends it's that ganesha had sort of devoured the the asura so he vanquished him by devouring him devouring him and uh, which is why he was uh, hot. very hot tapa tapa so he became very hot to cool him down what the devotees saw the devas brought this particular grass which was there and kept it on his head and that cooled him down it's very interesting how they have used the word seer for our rishi rishis in english are called seers because they really saw far beyond what we are seeing with our eyes they they saw much beyond and they have tried to give it forms and symbolism so this symbolism of offering this grass ganesha devouring this anala heat asura. and uh, all of this asura and all of this it is actually portraying so much more and to understand the, what we are really portraying is where we need masters like sri aurobindo and so many others who have come in this hori tradition of india of this land to guide us to understand the symbolism otherwise we get caught in the ritual we'll get caught in just plucking the grass and offering it and not really understanding why we are doing it how we should therefore shape our lives going forward so it's very very important get guided on understanding these kind of symbolism get to the deeper core of what our ancestors have tried to tell us through these various stories these legends and some of these uh, usual traditions and rituals so this particular grass is an ayurvedic remedy when the body gets ushna ushna is heat so there is this particular it's like a decoction what you call as kashayam in ayurveda today it is often had the juice of that grass is also drunk by people by people to sort of soothe the body cool cool the body down so that's so, so look at that what it is used in ayurveda to what you give it to uh, ganesha again it very well tallies so something for your body something for your mind so as a ritual it's for your mind and to make you more aware also as a juice it does bring in the same kind of benefit to your body too it's a big coolant so when you go for so many coolants today sherbets we have forgotten to have this particular coolant to the body which is a natural coolant today you put coolant in a inside a car for the car not to get heated up but we forget the, about that that is inanimate this is animate this body is animate we can use this coolant to cool ourselves so if the body is cool the mind is also cool when the body is heated mind is heated